Hello again. You in there, Hop? You're supposed to be dead. You're really not that excited to see me. I fight like hell to get back here and all I get is a, you're supposed to be dead? I thought you guys were trapped under rubble. We were, Miss Byers, but allow me to explain. You see, when the compound fell, we... Get out. Back away, back away! I will put the gun away. I really don't want to have to take off your head. I suggest you do the same. You shoot the sergeant, I'll shoot you. That's enough! Put your goddamn guns away! I said, that's enough. You're a very smart man. So you run things around here now? I do. Well, you've done a better job taking care of it than me. Why don't you and your, uh, comrades go ahead and take a seat over there? If you wouldn't mind dropping the body armor as well. That's everything we have. So if I recall, we were about to get the story on how you got out of the compound. It was quite a journey, I'll tell you that. We all did our part to escape. After the rubble came down, it didn't matter what we were. Russian or American, we were allies. We all helped each other escape. There's an old saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Well, I guess that applied at that time. We spent two days without food and water, just digging ourselves out of the rubble. Once we finally saw the sunlight, we tried to get our bearings, see what we could find. We found the plane wrecked, the pilot inside shot through the heart. We realized that there are some parts we were going to need to get to fix up the plane so that we could get out of Warsaw. And that, that all took a while. For months it was just scavenging from sunrise to sunset. We lost people along the way. We're all that's left. He spent months rummaging, huh? And what he did to contribute. Brenner was gone searching for parts for three days straight. He was the one that eventually found them and he fixed up the plane. He's the reason we're back here. As much as you criticize him, that man is the reason we're back here. He's the reason you're even seeing my face again. He built trust with me. So now you can see why I was a little pissed when he put a gun to his head. Yeah, that still doesn't make up for what he did. Once we got the plane started, we left that rock, but it didn't take long before the fuel ran low. Spent the rest of that time walking our way back, using boats, whatever we had to. We spent about two weeks here undetected before we just finally decided to make contact. And I guess we did at one of the worst times possible. So, Brenner was the one wearing the red visor. Does he know how to speak Russian? We had to learn or to communicate. I know I may not have made it seem like it, but I am glad you're back here. For Owen's sake. I can't tell you how happy I am to be back home. Owen's needs you. You should go talk to him. So you've come to speak to me. You know, I thought we squashed this back in our imprisonment, but I guess not. Seems like you're right back to hating me again. I hoped to God you wouldn't return. Even if it meant Obranovich and the rest of those men dying, I prayed you wouldn't come back. Why is that? So I wouldn't have the burden of killing you. So... We're not friends. I respect you for helping us escape the compound, but I still see you as a threat. No, we're not friends. And by the end of this, you will be dead. Mark my words. How much food do we have here? We have about a month's worth of canned food down in the basement. After that, we have some stuff that has to be cooked if you want to eat anything raw. I'm not starving to death. Perimeter is secure for now. We're lucky, they don't seem interested in getting in. The main gate is already giving way from the amount of Demodogs still trying to get in. 
If they started going after our doors, they would be here within seconds. One thing that's good is the power is still running. If those security cameras go off, we can only see them through the windows. That's a good point. While we still have water access, we need to try and bottle up as much as we can. I wouldn't be surprised if we spend a few days in here. And then, we find a way to deal with them. It's just streets of death out here. I think the police tried to help, but they didn't do that much good. What kind of world is this? We're still alive. We will stay alive. Thanks to that guy back there, we almost didn't survive. He didn't survive a whole house falling on him. Shit, Will, I'm sorry. Let's just get to where we're going. Speaking of that, where are we going? I figure we go to the lab. It's the most fortified place I know. Of course, if any of you have any other suggestions, I'm all ears. I guess we're going to the lab. Hey, what's up? Will's looking a little down. Would you mind help me out and watching over him? Of course. I don't think he's in the right mindset right now, that's all. He's our friend. I'll always help him. Are you okay? Going to the lab, I mean. I'm... I'm fine. Elle, if you... If you have a problem, you can tell us about it, okay? We'll understand. Mike, I'm fine, really. It's the best for us. What in the hell? What happened here? Damn, the dogs must have gotten to him. I think... I think they got the girl first. The mom tried to run and help, but got her throat ripped out in the process. There's a bullet wound in the side of the dad's head. He probably took himself out after seeing what happened to his family. This is just... <sighs> Only one shot fired. I guess we know why. You take it. You said you're better with the gun. She's got a knife too. I got an idea. Back at Will's house, that guy, he knew you too. I don't know what he wanted you for, but he was targeting you. And I don't think he's the only one. If there's a bounty on you guys, well then we have to make you, well, not recognizable. What are you saying? I think I'm gonna give you two a haircut. With that thing, well, you will sure make us not recognizable. If that's what it has to be. Don't worry, I'll try not to cut your heads open. So how'd I do? I think I'd give you a tip. <sighs> okay. Swarm of Demodogs coming to our right. Okay, move, go, go. Wait a minute, wait a minute, stay here. Shh, stay quiet, stay quiet, stay quiet. Okay, it's clear now. There's an alleyway down here, it'll get us back into the woods. What is that thing? Oh no. Run, run, go quick!
out. We don't want anything sneaking up on us. Does anyone need anything? I mean, we're getting pretty far out of the town. I think there might be a rest stop up ahead. But why are we leaving? There's a power station up ahead with the radio tower. If we get to that, we can camp out up there and wait for some help to come. Hopefully. Yeah, but it's still quite a walk. We'll get there in an hour or so. Hold it. I hear it too. Nancy, four o'clock. All right, you know the drill. All right, Nancy, hurry, this thing is strong. Okay, good job. That takes balls to do, man. Well, it's a good thing I have them. Let's keep moving, shall we? There we go. Alright, now we gotta be careful. There's gonna be a guard or two around the place. Oh, we'll be careful. Jonathan, I thought you said there were gonna be guards. I mean, I would assume there would be. They just might be hiding out somewhere, that's why we gotta be careful. This guy isn't looking so good. Please, please help me. They, they came for me. Oh, Jesus. He killed the others. I tried to stop him. He's probably talking about the Russians. You can't get in without a deep patch. You can't. Ah. Please help me, I gotta stop him. Can't get in without an ID badge, huh? He took the others. He took my friends. Nance. He... I... It's over. It's not like killing one of them. It's not at all. I got his badge. Let's get inside. Damn, no power. We gotta find a way to get the systems back online. Everyone split up and look around. There's a whole sea of them down there. They're so loud, it drives me nuts. You think that one gate can hold them all back? It has to. Sergeant Abranovich. This is Abranovich, over. We have things we need to discuss. I recommend you get back in here. Copy that, Abranovich out. So I think it's become very apparent that we have a very Serious situation right outside our doors. Do you guys have any other outposts? Anyone else you can call to come help? That's our next problem. All communications have went down. Electricity, water, everything is gone. So then how are the lights still on? Our generators are now all solar powered thanks to that little fiasco we had last year. We're lucky. Not a lot of people have power right now. So we can't contact anybody. If we try to, it won't go through. No one can receive our transmissions. The way we see it right now, we are on our own. Okay, well we can't just wait around here. We have roof access. You have machine guns. Why don't you just go up and start shooting them from there? We don't have the ammo for that. From just one look up there, it's at least 500. Think about how many other stragglers are surrounding us. That is what brings us to our next point. This. A drone? Found it in old storage closet. They'll be great for studying angles of herd. Won't work. That thing has never worked. No matter how many times I tried to reset it. Well, what's wrong with it? Electronic receivers went bad and it's incompatible with the controller. The receivers, huh? So, why don't we just install new ones? If you know how to fix it, be my guest. He knows how to fix it. Please fix it. 
Does anyone want to give me a toolbox? Just follow me. There. You should be able to control it right from the console. How did you do that? Uh, magic. It works. It actually works. That's what I keep telling you. Bob Newby, superhero. Good job. We'll take it up to the roof. Monitor it from the screens down here. Hold on, right there. There's a weak point right there, where there aren't so many gathered. You're right. Maybe we start shooting them from there. Oh, this could work. Owens, we found a weak point in the herd. If we shoot them from there, we could funnel them until they're all gone. How many guns do you have? Um, we have an M60 or two, several M4s, a semi-auto sniper. All in all, not enough to kill the herd. Great. Then what was this all for? We're back at square one. Well, we do have one thing. Which is? We have an APC with 250 cal machine guns mounted on it. That's excellent. Where is it? In your vehicle hangar? No. It's in our secondary armory, which is accessed by a hidden latch by the gate. So, in other words, through the herd. Yes. Perfect. Hold on, we might be able to get to it. Bob, it's past a herd. What do you expect us to do, walk through them? That's exactly what I want us to do. You must have a death wish. Bob, do you hear yourself? Wait a minute, hear me out. Hopper, last night we were in a car crash, right? Uh-huh. When the Demodox attacked us, you killed it with the knife, and in the process, you were covered in its blood. And then a Demodoc approached, but it didn't attack. It's like it didn't know you were there. That's because it didn't know you were there. The blood was covering your scent. The Demodocs hunt by blood. The Demodocs can't smell their blood. They don't know what they smell like. Therefore, it rendered you invisible to them. So to put it simply, they couldn't see me because I was covered in their blood. Precisely. That means... Well, Hop, I think you've just been presented a new form of camouflage. If we cover ourselves in their blood, we can walk through them. So, who wants to come with me to this garage? Well, you know I'm with you. I'm coming as well. If Bob is going, I'm going. I'll go too. No, you stay. Four people is enough. Eleven is alive. And Owens told me that you have custody of her. If there is a chance I could see her again, one last time I'm going to take it. Fine. But I doubt she'll want to see you. So how do we get a dog? Alright, just open it big enough for one of them to get through. And you guys up there, make sure you got a silencer on that rifle. We're ready when you are. All right, one is through. Close the gate. He's down. Target is neutralized. Get him inside. Okay, quickly now, quickly. We need to hurry. All right, now let's get him up. And inside. Well, that was pretty exciting, huh? Yeah. Now it's time for the fun part. Okay, you might want to stand back. I don't know how this thing will splatter. <clears throat> oh, yeah, that's not a good smell. Oh, I should have used my leg as an excuse. All right, gang, it's all for us. You guys are gonna open up the gate, but won't they tear apart the doors? 
As a final failsafe, an electronic barrier will come on, preventing them from opening up the doors. We'll be in the basement as well. Good luck. You'll definitely need it. Alright, remember. Stay together, act natural, move slow like they do. If you draw attention to yourself, it will break the disguise. If they're starting to notice you, do not panic. If we stay calm, we'll survive. Open the gate. So I found like a generator kind of in a room, but we need some kind of key to open it. But at least we have a way to get the power back on. Dustin? God damn it, where'd that kid go now? If he went back outside, I'm gonna kill him before the demodogs do. Shit. <laughs> Dustin! Get out of here. This guy really spooked me, Steve. Okay. Hold on now. Get out of here. I don't want you here. No, 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 I get that. But about the gun, you're really scaring me about the gun. The boy is scaring me. That's why I have the gun. These people have food, resources. I came in here. I killed them for it, but now, now people are figuring out they're gonna come in here. They're gonna kill me, take my food. I won't let them. So, so, so you did that outside with the guard? Put a piece of nice metal right through him. Gonna do the same to you, but you don't leave me the hell alone. I get it, but really, you should start pointing that gun at me rather than him. No, nah. Oh, in the hell. Ugh. I can't leave you alone for a minute without starting another fight. Uh, you'll never get it. You'll never get the keys. You'll never get me. <laughs> Shit. What's happening? The squatter just started some kind of alarm system. It's gonna bring every demodog in the county right on top of us. We gotta shut it off. We need to catch him. He has the keys. Keys to what? The power room has generators inside. That's how we get the electricity back on. Okay, we split up then. Me and John will go after the squatter. You guys find a way to get that alarm off. You're with me. There has to be some way to turn this goddamn thing off. Look around. Hey, there's like a keypad kind of thing. Okay, that's a start, but we need a code. And I really highly doubt they just put it on a piece of paper for us to find. Oh, well, that's convenient. Okay. Hopefully it wasn't on long enough for them to take notice. Why the hell is she letting off shots? Through here! Nancy. It's a pretty good drop down below. The monsters. Whatever the hell is out there, they're gonna get in here. They're gonna kill us all. Nancy, no! What are you doing? You can't just kill people like that. She's trying to kill us! Stop! Everyone, put your damn guns down! This world truly has gone to shit. No! <laughs> around see if he had the keys somewhere in here. I think I found it. Excellent. My god, what is taking him so long? I hope he knows what he's doing down there. Oh man, he did it. Let there be light. Why did we come back here? The sun is gonna set soon, and already with so many Demodoc patrols out, I don't think we'll be able to make it to the lab tonight. So does that mean you want us to stay in the trailer? It's the safest thing that's here. Chester needs some water, some to drink. I'm gonna go see if there's a river nearby. Don't wander off too far, I mean it. You got it. Reminds me of the old times, except I don't feel any much better than I did back then.
I hope this thing will just end. The military will do something about it. God, why did this happen? It's done. But we can't... We can't kill ourselves over it. Alright? We just... We have to make it through it. How much longer do you expect us to go on? We're just a bunch of kids. We will go on as much as we need. We're not gonna end up like that father of that family back there. Aren't you worried about your parents? Anyone close to you? My parents are vacationing in the Caribbean with their relatives. I don't know how, what it's like there, but you know, Mike, I just really prefer not to think about it much. My dad went on a business trip to California and my mom went with him. California is a populated place. You think they're all right? There's no reason for me to think they're not. Who I'm really worried about is Nancy. The girl knows how to use a gun. If there's any member of your family who I had to guess who's still alive, it would be her. Jonathan, my mom, Bob. I don't know where they're at. Chester's the only one right now who's really keeping me sane. This whole thing could drive anyone mad. Your mom and Bob are most likely with Hopper. Alright, do you know how badass that guy is? Will, you have to believe that your family is okay. You can't... You can't believe the worst. Hi, Miss Hop. Yeah, that makes sense. He's our only family. That's not true. You three, Dustin, Hopper, you're all my family. If a man can't stand, a man can't fight. If he can't stand, he can't live. We have to stick together. If we do that, we will win. You're right. So no more bullshit about hoping people are alive and hoping you'll see them again. Because they are alive and you will see them again. I can tell you all that. Sorry, Hop. We're not sitting in the basement like some damn cowards. This is a herd. It's tightening. They might be starting to notice the ones I shoot. We're good for right now. Don't get trigger happy. They're doing just fine. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to lose track of them. They must be getting closer. They're nearly at the gate. What do we do? Hold on. I think I got one on Brenner. Are you sure? Uh, yeah, I... I think so. Wait, we need to be certain. We bring down too much unnecessary attention, they're done down there.
can't take the shot. Why not? She's way too close. I'll hit her. Burner. Burner, put that goddamn thing away. She needs help. No, she's fine. Don't do her that goddamn gun. Gun! Stop firing that thing! No! Joyce! No! Bob! We have to go. Down here, let's go! This is it. The APC. So we're gonna use to kill the Horde. We're actually gonna get rid of it. We're gonna get out of this place. Can't you believe- oh! I'm gonna kill you now. Wait a minute now. You know what, Brenner? I'm not sure there is a possible thing you can say to me to make me change my mind. Stop. Why are you killing me? Are you retarded? Do you know what happened out there? I saved us. I was gunning them all down. I was, I was helping you guys get out. You didn't do shit. I'm a hero. No. Bob is a hero, because he actually saved a life. You? You took everything from her. Can you honestly look her in the eyes and tell her that you're a hero? I'm not gonna give you the easy way out. You're gonna live, and you're gonna live with what you did. I found a shower house. I think we can get this blood off of us. Thanks, Marvin. I'll be there in a minute. I... I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. I... I know he was good to you. And he deserves so much more than what he got. He's really gone, and it almost feels like it's here, but he's not, he's not, he's really gone. Yeah, I know. What will I tell Will and Jonathan? He was like a father to them, and they lost two fathers. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You are strong, and you will get through this. You have to believe in that yourself. Your family is strong, Joyce. But for right now, for right now, we still have a mission to finish. We'll mourn him later. But bigger things are at stake right now. You're right. Okay, you're right. You're right. We gotta find my sons. How about you go and get yourself cleaned off, yeah? So, um, I found a tunnel that connects to this armory place. If we follow it, it should lead us back to the surface. Okay. We'll take a few minutes to catch our breath, and then we'll figure out how we're gonna do this. Were you... Were you really gonna kill him? I really wanted to, I did. I wanted Joyce to tell me to kill him, but... We need him, Marvin. Right now, for this to go perfect, we need all hands on deck.